Hello and welcome to the second episode of Ask the EV Guru. We've been monitoring your comments and emails and we've got a lot of questions about electric vehicles in the rains. Many of you are worried that there might be some damage to the battery pack or the electronics or some other part of an electric car that you might get an electric shock if you ride your electric vehicle in the rains. So we thought what better way to allay your doubts and fears than to actually go on an EV ride in the pouring rains of Mumbai. So uh, water logging in Mumbai and many other Indian cities are, is a big problem especially in low lying areas. And as you can see many a times we have to wade the water where the water level is as high as our knees. For our car we went through water that was up to the level of the door of the car and we did not have any problems whatsoever. There were other vehicles, even SUVs, which could not go through that much water. And not having a tailpipe definitely makes a big difference where there is no place for the water to go into your car. Okay, so now let's do a drive in the electric car. And I'm going to take this car out in the waterlogged streets of Mumbai and come back and then put the car back on charge. Okay, so I have made it back from my ride in the pouring rains. And now we are going to put the car on charge. Whenever I park the car, I ensure that there is enough shade to protect my car from the elements. Also, even though electric cars can go through water and you can use them in the rain, it doesn't mean you drown the entire charge box in rain. Please keep it covered. Use an appropriate place, location where there is enough ventilation so that there is heat dissipation. And then you can charge your car or your motorcycle safely even when it's raining. So here is an electric scooter that's charging. And if you notice, I plan to take it out in the pouring rain. And after I get back in my rainy ride, I will put it back to charge again. As you can see, it's not much of a problem to ride your EVs during the rains. EVs are much more resilient than you think. However, we caution you to just check if your vehicle is listed in the ARAI, the Automotive Research Association of India, which is a Pune based organization that certifies electric vehicles. As of now, all the electric four wheelers are ARAI certified. However, for the two wheelers and three wheelers, you do need to take care because there are a lot of fly by night operators which assemble stuff and give it to you. They may not be able to offer you the standard and quality that a good ARAI certified company can. So for those of you who are more technically inclined and you want to see the list of what a car has to go through to actually pass ARAI certification, check out AIS 138 in the link given below. Automotive industry standard for electric vehicles is defined in that. So most of these components have to undergo something called homologation. Now homologation makes sure that your car works well for the location in which you are purchasing and using the car. So how do you know if your vehicle is ARA certified? Check with your dealer, ask for a certificate or look at the FAME website. FAME is the faster adoption and manufacturing of electric vehicles. This is a policy aimed at uh, accelerating the growth and the development of manufacturing of electric vehicles in India. For FAME, check out the link below. So finally, whether your electric vehicle is ARI approved or not, here are some basic tips to help you uh, use your electric vehicles during the rain. First of all, park in an area which is shaded and protected from the rain. Secondly, if your vehicle has removable batteries like a scooter, then take your batteries home and charge them over there. Make sure that you charge your electric vehicle in a dry area because many vehicles, even though they are of good manufacture, the chargers are from some cheaper suppliers and they may not be IP56 compliant. And finally, drive slow and stay safe. Make sure that the tire pressure is correct, not too much, so that there's enough friction between the tire and the road. We at Plugin India are in touch with lots of EV owners. And as you can see from our video, our EV community loves the EVs and the EVs love the rains. So using or, or charging electric vehicles in the rains are perfectly safe and there is nothing to worry about. So enjoy the independence of using an electric vehicle and the independence from uh, using the petrol pumps in the pouring rains. So if you like this video, please do like, comment and subscribe to our channel and share this with your friends. You can also support us on patreon.com. This video is made possible by Mahindra Electric. Mahindra Electric Mobility is the pioneer of electric vehicle technology in India. Their mission is to bring tomorrow's movement today. Please visit their website at www.mahindraelectric.com.